Hey everybody, Nick Acosta here from Unrendered Media. Uh, Happy New Year. Uh, I know I haven't released a video in quite a while. Uh, that's because I've been currently working on my new film, Riddance. I was hoping to release a new video last month during December for the holidays, but uh, kind of got swamped working on that film. And with the holidays and Christmas and everything, it just got overwhelmed and I just couldn't do it. Uh, so I'm releasing this video now to let you guys know that I'm still making videos and still working. In fact, right now I'm in post-production on my film, which uh, kind of took a small break because uh, we had some technical issues with the hard drive, but no worries, we backed everything up and we are working that out right now and we might be able to recover a lot of the data. So good news. But yeah, uh, I decided to show you guys some behind the scenes of what we've been doing, what I've been doing, and of the making of the short. Yeah, and get ready to see a lot more this year. Um, possibly even me making my first feature film. Uh, hopefully, we'll see. Maybe sometime this summer or next fall we'll make it. Uh, have your fingers crossed. Uh, until then, uh, catch you guys later and hope you enjoy. Going back and showing little flashes yeah. of what things have been like. One bit of it could be trying to show her how to load a weapon. Gotcha. And we could still keep that distance and not break that linear thing that you're talking about, not have them touch it. Yeah. But the long before we ever know that she's going to need it to use against him. We could just start taking other shit and be like, look, here's the way gravity works. Yeah. <laughs> nice, right? Yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> you know, and, and get it, like, just be... Hello everybody, I'm here at HPR and we're about to go find some props for our movie, Riddance. And guess what room I'm in? Yep, the gun room. Like I said, Nick, it's time to go. <laughs> AKs. Guns. I don't get to play with this many guns in a room at once, so I'm taking advantage of it. Hey, that was fun. Look at our props. Awesome. All right, let's go make a movie. I couldn't keep up with the cleaning. That is the wrong time. Is that it? Is that all of it? This is all of it, except for the other thousand. That's right. It smells like movies. <laughs> Energy. So, uh, ref service that I took of being made. Nice. So, we just got up the mountain, uh, Big Bear. We're technically in Big Bear, but we're still like, what, 10 miles? 10 miles? About 10 miles out. 10 miles out to the location, actually to the hotel. Or I'm not sure, we could picking up the, the keys first and everything, but whatever. We're almost there. First off, I just want to thank all you guys for coming out here. First off, no doubt, um, it's going to be a great shoot. We're going to keep it going. Um, when Nick is rehearsing with the actors, uh, please like to be respectful and give the actors and Nick their space. Getting kind of cold and all that good fun stuff. But again, if you guys have any problems or concerns, please call. I don't care what time it is. If you're wake up at three in the morning, you had a bad dream and you want to talk about it, you know my number. Give me a call. We'll talk. We'll do it, you know. I'm in room 127. Come knock on it. You might wake Mitch up, but don't worry about him. He's scrawny. He can't do nothing. <laughs> Everyone in here can take him. Don't even worry about it. So you got a little guest here? He doesn't hurry in my person. <laughs> Everyone wave. <laughs> Having a good time. So I'm the first one up this morning. Uh, actors are coming into set today. We're doing a lot today. It's the first day shoot, so I'm kinda nervous. So got a lot to take care of, and I mean a lot. Over 50 shots. But um, I'm confident. 
brilliant. Wish us luck. Can we take these down or are they in the shop? They're in the shop. Shit. You're safe there. I'll take two. Mark. Stand by, please. And action. What's up, buddy? Oh, man. It's the same face I made on, on the friend request. My contacts are dried out, which means uh, I've been riveted to the screen, so I can't blink much. It's a good thing. Uh, and uh, this production has been going very well. I'm very pleased. We're more or less on schedule. Get everybody fully on schedule when you're going through the creative process. Uh, this is an amazing crew. One of the best I've worked with uh, since I worked at the studios. It's a big compliment. Uh, some of these people, if not all of these people, are going to be people I'm going to be calling back to work with again. Maybe even the director. <laughs> We're very close here. Aww. Aww. You should have played Dean. Aww. We all stuck it out. Actually, that's what I. We all stuck by this for a year. It's been a year process. Mm -hmm. What do you think of how the movie is going, ooh, Nick? Ooh, ooh, she's ninja in your shit. Uh, this is one of the smoothest productions I've ever had. I mean, it, it's, it's filled You're with welcome. its usual, usual... Why do you think that is, Nick? It's filled with its usual stresses that we usually have, you know. Um, like, are we going to make in time? Are we going to have shots? Are we going to cut shots? All oh, this, this, that. Life's going down. But it's really smooth because we have, for one, I'm... I have the right crew this time. I have the right crew. I mean, I've always had the right crew, but I have the right, the, the best crew I could ever have right now. All right, everyone, that is a wrap. Thank you. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Bye. Nice to see you, too. I think it's a matter if we get one more clip. I like that she keeps going. We can totally do the scene from Romeo and Juliet right now. That's what we're kind of doing right now. This is how every DP wants to light every shot, but they can't usually get the light like they can't, they six, can't do three inches from somebody's face. I know, right? <laughs> and lighting on a this, is the most I, this is the most ideal situation for this lighting right here, or for the scene. Well, most ideal would be a uh, wait. Would be like you know, if I if I had a if I could have like a latte, I'll send just like a magically appear in my hand. But you know, that's you don't have the budget. For Let me get you a latte. Yes, I'm on my way. Here I go. <laughs> <laughs> so, how you guys doing? I think this is real great. Excellent. Nick's really great to work with. Nick is really great to work with. <laughs> we really enjoy his easygoing demeanor on set. Good. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, that is a wrap on Mr. Jim Eric. Merry Christmas, everybody. Gentlemen, walk your car real quick. <laughs>